Now that all gyms and fitness centers across the state are shutting down due to COVID-19, fitness instructors are forced to get creative. As News Channel 5 Cena Sleem shows us, some are making the switch to virtual classes. It's definitely not the same. But fitness coach Ariella Boykane says the last few weeks have been interesting. She's used to leading large groups of people, but lately she's had to be selective. To make some adjustments within the group of 10, um, you know, I would make sure that they were six feet away. So, you know, putting cones out to say, hey, go find a cone. That's where a person's mat goes. So just making sure that you're not getting closer than six feet. Tuck those elbows in close to the sides. On Sunday, Governor Lee signed an executive order shutting down gyms and fitness centers. Let's see if I can get where you can see me. It has people itching to find ways to exercise and stay active while isolated. One. Two. Now fitness instructors are making the switch to virtual classes. Down. Right now there are so many opportunities to work out, work out from home. Instructor Cheryl Kimball is teaching her dance classes online through Zoom. We really just want to see people get moving and not eating all those snacks that they went and bought for their quarantine. Every little bit counts and it'll keep that cabin fever from really setting in. There have been challenges. If you don't have good connection, you know, those those programs still cut out and it makes it glitchy. So it makes those at home following along really, you know, it makes it difficult for them to actually keep up. up we got mountain climbers in three, two, one and go. Here we but go. But instructors are trying to make the best out of the unique situation. We're still keeping them engaged. You know, if I want to give you a high five online, send the high five emoji, you know, things like that. Okay, so keep your shoulders down and you're just going to dip. Cheering on their clients one, two, from the other side of one, the screen. Two. Sina Sleem, News Channel 5.